Hey pilots, settle in. We've got news about an important feature to share with you. Dramatic pause. Pilots are coming to NAC Arena. Not you, of course. You're already here. No, we're talking about special in-game characters that will give a bunch of bonuses to your max. Now, I know some of you expressed concerns about pilots before, and I'm here today to get you a clearer understanding of how this feature is going to work. It should put your mind at ease. We've taken a lot of time to study how similar features work in other games and determine it how to add more depth to Mac Arena while avoiding the pitfalls and errors that make those features fall flat elsewhere. Firstly, the skills of our pilots won't be randomized. In fact, you'll get quite a few customization options. We'll also make sure FTP players have ways of getting into this feature so it doesn't just become pay to win. For example, we plan on having events with pilots at the price, available to anyone. In fact, we've leaned heavily on the survey many of you guys completed while Mac Arena was still in beta. So, what exactly can the pilots offer you aside from getting a shiny in-game character and some insights into the world of Mac Arena? Well, at their most basic, pilots increase the HP of your mechs and the damage of your weapons. Those bonuses will further increase as the pilots level up and get higher ranks, but what really makes them shine is their implant skills and innate skills. Implant skills will affect different things such as weapon damage, ability duration, and so on. Any pilot can use an implant, but pilots also have innate skills that can be changed. Not all implants are good for every pilot. By combining different implants and pilots, though, you'll be able to really customize your hangers and mag builds. You can get new implants from the shop by spending echoins or credits, just like getting blueprints. Implants and pilots both have rarities, and just like max and weapons, you can install any rarity implant on any pilot. Red, the first pilot you'll get access to, can use even the rarest possible implant skills. When you get different pilots later on, you can always swap out the implant for a few A coins. Experiment as much as you like. Also, while pilots can use more than one implant, they can stack up implants that affect the same parameter. So if you get a pair of, say, shotgun damage implant, a pilot can only use one of them, not both. And while these implant skills and innate skills can be fun and let you customize your Macarena experience, they never go in to replace your actual skill at the game. Juggernauts with super strong shotguns are still going to be very vulnerable to a panther with longers. And of course, an enemy can always counter your pilot with a pilot of their own. Instead of depending on them, use the possibilities open up by the implants you find and the pilots you unlock to explore new options or strengthen your existing playstyle. Whether it's an extra punch on your favorite guns, or a bit of bonus for your max abilities, or even countermeasures to another mech tricks, you'll get to personalize your tactics like never before. Just remember that your enemies can do that too. Alright, that's the mechanical side of pilots, but it's not the only side. Each pilot is also, you know, a person, with backstories, personalities, friendships and rivalries. We've been eager to explore the setting of Mac Arena with you guys, and our pilot's future is our first real window into this world. This isn't the last video we are making about the pilots either. Later on, we'll dive deeper into the actual mechanics of this feature, so hit like and subscribe if you want to be the first one to see it. Good hunting!